Hey guys, in this video, we'll be talking about the bottom sheet dialog. It is included in the material design library. So let's jump into Android Studio and see how it is implemented. So let's start by creating a new project. Let's call that bottom sheet dialog. Next, and then we'll start with the basic activity because we'll get the design support library included in the dependencies. Otherwise, we have to manually add them because bottom sheet dialog requires the material design library. So let's go to our layout file, layout folder, sorry, and create a new uh, resource file for the bottom sheet dialog. Let's call it bottom sheet and root element to be a linear layout. And before doing anything in this, let's go to our drawable folder folder and add in four vector assets or rather three vector assets. One is for sharing. Click OK and click next and finish and another one and let's call it upload let's choose the cloud upload one next and finish and add in another asset of copy that is the content copy and click on ok and next and finish Now inside the bottom sheet uh, XML, let's add in our linear layout. That is the first linear layout. And let's give it a width of match parent and height of wrap content like this. And add in, we'll add in an image, image with a width of say 48 dp and a height of 48 dp again. And its source will be from the drawable and that is the share icon I'll choose like this that 48 is too much let's keep it 24 dp and height will be also 24 dp like this and uh, let's give it a tint of say color accent and let's add in a text view Text view would be wrap content, wrap content, and its text would be share, share, and its layout gravity would be center. Not the gravity, but the layout gravity would be center vertical, like this. And let's give it a padding of. Uh, say 16 dp or 8 dp might be whatever is good for you and let's also give it a padding of uh, say 8 dp and uh, not the padding but the margin here we'll take margin of 8 dps like this and so this is our first linear layout inside our linear layout and note one thing its orientation is horizontal like this and let's give it id of of share share linear layout like this and let's copy this linear layout and paste it two more times to get our other two rows for action buttons uh, we will call it uh, upload linear layout and its uh, text would be upload and its icon would be ic upload underscore upload content upload and for the last one we will ca call it copy linear layout like this and its icon would be the ic content copy and its text would also be copy 
so basically this is our bottom action sheet and so let's get back to our main activity and before doing anything in the main activity let's uh, open the content main dot uh, sorry the activity main dot xml and just delete this floating action button from here and inside the main activity also let's delete all the code relating to the floating action button and inside the activity main or rather the content main dot xml we'll add in a button to show the dialog what would be wrap content wrap content and text would be uh, show dialog like this and let's give it a style style would be at style widget dot app compare dot button dot colored like this and for the text view let's uh, give it a id do we have an id of text view no we don't so let's give it an id of say text view like this and let's give it a style so style would be text appearance dot compare dot display one and let's remove all the constraints of this let's go to the design tab and click on the button let's construct it in the middle of our view and let's make a connection of the text view to the bottom of the button like this and let's give it a margin of say 16 so now go and uh, one more thing we have to do in this uh, main active in this content main dot xml we have to set an on click listener on this button on click show dialog let's add in a method for this in the main activity so this is our method now let's run our application and see if everything is working fine so yeah everything is working fine we don't have any errors now inside our main activity class let's uh, find uh, let's uh, create uh, an object of our linear layout that is the share linear layout linear layout and the upload linear layout upload linear layout and the copy linear layout like this and we need our button also so button would be our so we don't need a button because we already have a method for that button and we need to implement an on click listener in the on this class so implement view view dot on click listener and we have to implement its method that is the on click let's create a new method uh, let's call it uh, private void create bottom sheet dialog like this and let's also make an object of our bottom sheet dialog bottom sheet dialog bottom sheet dialog like this and if bottom sheet dialog is equal to is not equal to null then what we'll do we'll create our bottom sheet dialog and to create our bottom sheet dialog first we need to get the layout uh, file or rather we need to get the view from our layout file so we'll call it uh, linear layout rather let's just call it view view equal to layout inflator dot from context is this this class that is and inflate and which resource we want to inflate we want to inflate our bottom sheet and its parent to be null like this and uh, we need to enter a semicolon there and for a bottom sheet so bottom sheet dialog is equal to new bottom sheet dialog and we need to pass in the context here so we need to pass this 
and we need to set a content view for this bottom sheet dialog to take our view as in a content for this bottom sheet so we will pass in this view because we have just created that view and we need also we also need to find these uh, individual linear layouts so let's uh, find them out share linear layout equal to view dot find view by id r dot id dot share linear layout like this and the upload linear layout equal to view dot find view by id r dot id dot upload linear lay upload linear layout and the same thing for the copy linear layout also and we also need to implement on click listeners also on these layouts so what we'll do we'll say shell linear layout dot set on click listener will be this class again and uh, upload linear layout dot set on click listener would be this again and for the copy also the same thing this like this so everything is done here what we need to do before doing anything let's call this method to initialize our bottom sheet dialog and whatever what we want to do when we click on the button that is to show dialog button what we want to do bottom sheet dialog dot show and uh, this is an on click let's remove it from here show dialog will come here bottom sheet dialog dot show and here we'll use a switch tag not the tag but the switch statement view dot get id and it's case case r dot id dot shell linear layout and break and let's copy this and it would be upload linear layout and the third case would be copy linear layout copy linear layout like this and what we want to do we want to dismiss the bottom sheet dialog before dismissing the bottom sheet dialog what we'll do we'll display something in the text view so let's grab our text view text view equal text view text view like this and we'll find the text view inside the on create method itself text view equal to find view by id r dot id dot text view and now here what we'll do we'll set the text of the text view to be because it's a share click so we'll uh, display something like share and after setting the text of the text view we'll want to we want to dismiss the bottom sheet dialog so we'll just call bottom sheet dialog dot dismiss like this let's copy these two lines and paste it in the other two switch statements uh, this is a upload linear layout so we'll say something like upload and this is the last one is the copy linear layout so we'll just copy in the copy and one more thing if you want to do you can go to your bottom sheet and you can use a background for these linear layout so it would be a ripple effect so how to apply a ripple effect it's simple just use the android attribute of selectable item background like this just copy this and paste it in the other two linear layouts also now let's run our application I think everything is fine so let's open our emulator the show dialog bottom sheet dialog has stopped so why has it stopped let's go to a lock cat and see what's the problem here could not execute a method for on click in activity 74 bottom sheet dialog dot show oh we are getting this error because we have initialized it incorrectly it should be when bottom sheet dialog is equal to null then we have to create a new bottom sheet dialog like this so now let's run our application again now let's click on show dialog so here we have our bottom sheet dialog and if we click on share we'll get the share if we click on upload 
we get upload and if you click on copy so we get copy so you can use anything inside this bottom sheet that so as long it is consistent with the material design guidelines so that's all about bottom sheet dialog and you can also use a list view or a recycler view inside this bottom sheet dialog so thank you bye bye tata take care have a good day